Hello, Soul Cooking with T family and friends. Listen, it is Super Bowl Sunday. I know you are getting ready to hear and see Rihanna and all of the festivities at the Super Bowl. So listen, I'm home. You may hear some noise. You may hear some screaming. You may hear the TV. We do not hold the rights to the music you may hear in the background when Rihanna goes live. Listen, it's this annual Super Super Bowl snack. So here we go. Listen, I wanted you to come on in, come on in. Listen, take time, share this out with your family and friends. Listen, I know y'all see the smile on my face. And the reason I'm smiling, because listen, my cameraman, my cameraman is back in California, y'all. Soul cooking with tea. Listen, it is on and popping because I've had to be the cameraman, the setup man. I've had to do it all. But listen, it was a learning experience for me. But we are excited to have him back. Chris, he don't want to come on camera right now, but don't worry. Y'all will get a chance to see him. Uh, come on. So today, listen, I'm making something quick, simple, and easy. We're going to make a lime and cilantro uh, dressing. And I have it right here already. So I've used some extra virgin olive oil. I'll make sure I add the recipe uh, on the site. I got the recipe from loveandlemons.com. So that you see me looking over you probably can see the ipad because i want to make sure i get it correctly okay with this with the um ingredients because remember it's important that you use the right measurements so i've used some olive oil i've used some sea salt you use whatever you know brand you would like uh whatever kind of honey you would you know like uh some coriander this was new to me uh i use lemons instead of lime i use minced garlic instead of fresh garlic and then I also added some Greek yogurt. My Greek yogurt has a little honey into it. So I'm going to push all that to the side. It's going to be noisy for a second because I need to go ahead and get this dressing going. So just give me a second. This quick, fast, and in a hurry. I want to get the dressing going. Very simple. Once you put all of the ingredients together, okay, I want to show it to you all. So hopefully the cameraman can see it, let you all see. So y'all give us a few minutes because, listen, we readjusting to things. Uh, he told me to put it down. So listen, that's what I like. He tells me what exactly what to do. He gives me the thumbs up that lets me know that you all can see the dressing. And so the dressing is ready. You see how simple it was? You put all your ingredients together. So give me a second because guess what? I want to go to our Facebook page. Because I want to make sure I see who's here with us live and so cooking with tea. So give me a second. Let me see. Can I get to the page? Because you know, things have changed. But I want to make sure that I can see you all. Hold on. Let me see. If it is showing. Oh, there it is. Now I'm going to see if I can see who's with me today. So I can say hello to you all. That's what I want to do. Okay, I need to get to the page now. Let's go to the page. Hey, I told you Facebook has changed a lot. So let me see. Let me turn it down. Oh, hello, hello, Gina. Hello. She says, hi, Chris. So, I told you. Oh, my other ingredient, the, one of the main ingredients is the cilantro. Here's the cilantro. So, what I've done, uh, I just pull it off. I had some stems in there when I was making it. So, as you can see, I have a red pepper, I have a yellow pepper, and I have an orange pepper, and I have a tomato. So, I'm going to sit the, the tomatoes to the side. I think... I'm going to use a yellow pepper. Uh, and so I know you're probably saying, well, what is she going to do with the pepper? So I'm going to go ahead and just cut it just like that. And I want to take this inside out. And we're going to make a quick snack. Quick. I'm talking very quick. I think I can get you all back so that you all will be able to see Rihanna. So don't forget when I, many shows I've done, uh, remember I said, do not cross-contaminate what you're using. Make sure you use one particular knife, one cutting board for one particular thing. So I have green, that's for vegetables. I have a green uh, cutting board. I use that for all of my vegetables. Okay, so as you can see, I just took that pepper out. I'm telling you, this is so simple. You're going to go to your Walmart, your Target's your Publix, whatever grocery store you go to or your market, and you're going to do this. You're going to be like, I didn't think, why I didn't think about that? Okay? So I'm just going to cut it. Just cut it in half. However you like. See? I got a small piece. I got a big piece. And so what I think I'll do, 
is I'll cut it again. See, my cameraman is in the back, and he's telling me something. What is that one? Oh, see, he's trying to tell me. Oh, no. We just, we doing peppers. <laughs> he's telling me I have bread in the back. And see, he forgot that we were just doing veggies today. So, as you can see, I just cut my pepper. Just cut it, and I slice it up. Because this is a very simple snack. Now, if you're making this snack for someone out outside of your home, I encourage you to use gloves, but I'm making it for myself and my family. I've already washed my hands. I make sure that I'm clean before I come on camera. But remember, if you're making it for others, make sure you wear the proper gloves and everything, okay? So I just got some turkey and I'm just gonna put a little piece of turkey, just a little piece, that's all we need. We don't need nothing big, just, just a little snack um, on this one. I have a little ham, so I just, look, I'm just handing it off. Nothing, nothing big. I'm gonna put it in there. Let me set all this to the side, because I want y'all to see this quick, easy snack, okay? I got a little lettuce. It's up to you if you want lettuce. Uh, you don't have to. Uh, I also have a tomato, so on one of them, I'm just gonna put, oh, this, oh yeah, my knife is sharp. Because sometimes the knife don't be too sharp. So I'm just gonna slice, a thin slice of tomato. But you can put whatever you like on your peppers and your sandwich. You see what I did? So on one side, let me make sure I get it right because we don't want to mess up. That goes to that. That goes to that. Guess what? We're going to take a little of this dressing. I forgot a spoon. Hold on, guys. Let me get a spoon. That's a fork. Okay, Mr. Spoon, can you show up today? All right. All right. We got a spoon. So, we're going to take a little of this dressing. All right, let me see who's with me. Hello, 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 Grace. Thank you so much for joining. Uh, Cayman Glass, hopefully I said your name correctly. Welcome, welcome to Soul Cooking with Tea. Tell your family and friends about us, okay? So, I'm going to take a little bit of this, and I'm just going to put it on my tomato. Just a, just a couple of drizzles. You see that? Just a couple of drizzles. Now... Just, you know what, I might add a little bit more. Just a little bit more. A little bit more. A little bit more, okay? So let me put this over here. Put the top back on it. Now, if you want to make it thicker, just add more cilantro to the mix. Guys, y'all give me one second as I walk away. Hold on just a second. Woo! Okay. So, now I've added what I want to add. Now, you could also add some peppers. I got some more things over here. You could add some olives. Let's see what else we have over here. Woo. We got some jalapeno peppers. So it's just really totally up to you. Okay, let's see what else we have. Oh, we have some sweet pickles. You can add the sweet pickles to the side, or if you like just a regular pickle, you could also use a regular pickle, you know, and add it to the side, okay? Let me move that fork. Let me get my plate. I told you it's a quick Super Bowl snack. Now we're gonna make a sandwich, guys. Y'all be like, girl, what? Yes, a sandwich. That's it. And put it on there however you like. Y'all see that? A sandwich. Just a, a sandwich. Something simple, something quick. I use my lime cilantro dressing on it. And guess what? We about to taste it. Okay, guys? You're gonna hear the crunch. Mm-hmm. 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 Hold on. Woo! Hold on. That pepper is sweet. That cilantro dressing, because you add the honey to it, it has just a little sweetness to it. And then also remember, I added Greek yogurt. You can, you know, whatever kind of Greek yogurt you want to use. And I got one which has honey in it. So that just gave me a little bit. I hope I don't have it around my mouth because my cameraman ain't said nothing, so hopefully we don't. Wait, we gotta have another bite, y'all. Wait, hold on. Mmm. With that ham. Mmm. You can taste the cilantro. Oh, this is amazing. So, again, it was just a simple, simple snack. I used a bell pepper. Again, you can use whatever color bell pepper you like. And today I just chose to use the yellow. You can use the red, whatever color, and I'll make sure I share. Y'all, they're so good. Mm. 
I'm trying to talk, but it's good. But I'll make sure I share, mm, excuse me, the recipe with you all on Soul Cooking with Tea. And let me see who else is joining us today. Listen, tell your family and friends about Soul Cooking with Tea. Again, I'm Tawana Carlton. I am your host of Soul Cooking with Tea. So tell your family, tell your friends, and listen, I got you through so that you can go in and now you can watch and enjoy the Super Bowl halftime show. Thank you again for joining us for our annual Super Bowl halftime snack. Quick snack. Quick snack. Bye, y'all.